Good morning, everyone. So, I'm just getting over the flu. I'm also just getting up and I'm home alone. So I figure what better time to do this and do somewhat of a clean with me, chat with me. So, yeah. Today is Friday, uh, March 1st, so happy March. And um, yeah, I've been sick since the last Friday, could not go to work. Had fever, had the whole nine, like I was just so sick. Worst feeling ever. And um, yeah, went to the doctor and as we all know with the flu, you have to Stay in bed, drink lots of fluids, um, just let it run its course. So I'm gonna try and attempt a little clean with me, chat with me, a little bit of everything. And yeah, so normally when I get up in the morning, what I like to do, and I don't do this often because I don't have time during the week, so I tend to do it more like on the weekends. I just like to literally disinfecting every day as much as possible so yeah usually what I like to do is um <clears throat> drink some hot water lemon and apple cider again I don't do this often but I try to whenever I can it's supposed to be good for you it's supposed to be detoxifying so that's what I'm going to start off with I'm going to do a little line. So, what I like to do, I just slam it around a little bit and this gets like all the juices flowing. I'll just put a squeeze in about a half. And that's about it. I prefer a lime. I don't feel like it's as sour as a lemon. It just tastes better to me in my opinion. But if there's no lime available, I would definitely, I would do the lemon. So, you've had apple cider before you know this isn't the best tasting thing but I'll add about a tablespoon and a half that was more like two and I'll sweeten with some honey again this is supposed to be good for you um, it's detoxifying, helps boost up your immune system, which I need right now. And it's more of a weekend thing for me, like I said. I wish I had the time to do this every day, but I don't. So, I'm just going to sip on this. Blast the music, have my moment. That's another thing when I drink this, I also like to just have um, either music or quiet. That's like my me time. That's my mo that's my time to like mentally prepare. I think about how I want my day to go, what I have to do, and yeah, this is how I do it. And normally after this, I'll wait about an hour, half hour, depending how I'm feeling. Then I'll have my first cup of coffee and get my day started, so. So normally when I'm alone, I'll sit here and like I said, I'll have my tea, my coffee, just depending um, what I'm drinking at the moment. And I usually don't sit here because um, the husband is usually here. So 
this is his face. I'll go to the office, but I'll just sit here and reflect. This is my little sequence journal. I'll write down here what I want to plan for the day. Um, sort of like my to-do list, but not sort of, but sort of, right? And if I have to sort through my planner, then this is when I'll do it as well. And yeah. I'll either listen to like some Joel Osteen or some um, Stephen Furtick, some inspirational stuff. Like this is my time to do it. If not, like today it's Friday and I just want to pump myself up. So I'll listen to some music and right now currently I'm listening to house, some house music and yeah. So yeah, Alexa, play. So now that I'm finished having my tea and doing my little journaling and planner, I'm gonna wash the dishes. I'm gonna start off with that and um yeah, I still have the sniffles, but it was still lingering. Let's get started. I usually like to use either Mrs. Myers or Purpose Cleaner and this one is sort of new to my cleaning regimen and this is the Method Daily Granite um, cleaner smells like apples and actually it's apple orchid yeah cleans and polishes I love the way this smells so usually alternate between the two and today I'm gonna go with Mrs. Myers no, we're not going with Mars. We're going with the method. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah No, I don't want to waste what's left And on and on We'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And on and on We'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways And on Okay, so I'm having iced coffee today. 
and my latest obsession. I haven't tried the mocha flavor, but I'm gonna give this one a try right now. And why aren't you focusing? There we go. So I'm gonna try this one today, the flavor. I love the, van the vanilla and I love the black coffee. Like those are my favorites. So what I do is I'll just about up to there. And then I'll take my new favorite creamer, almond milk. So good. And I'll just fill it to the top because that's how I like my coffee. And then. these metal sh metal straws my husband isn't a fan of them I prefer them I think they're just environmentally better but I'm mean, into each their own oh my god this is so good yes mocha yes so good. You ever have that feeling when coffee first touches your soul, that first instinct, and it's like amazing? Yeah. Oh my God. Let me get back to cleaning. Alexa on. So I'm just gonna like freshen them up. So what I like, sorry, my battery died. So I don't have much left in here, but what I like to use is downy. I already fluffed up the pillows last night, so I'm just gonna refresh them real quick. I love to use the scent boosters. I put it in here with some hot warm water, um, shake it up, make sure it melts. And I will spray everything down. Couches, pillows, bed, curtains, the whole shebang. Spray it down and it just keeps everything smelling so fresh and so clean. And yeah, I find that downy scent so comforting. So that's why I do it. But there's many different ways to freshen up your home. But this is my favorite way. And honestly... Honestly, I feel like this lasts a whole lot longer than Febreze. Like this will just keep everything smelling fresh for days. So, yeah.
what I love about this house is that I don't have a lot yet because I just moved in. So there isn't a lot to dust. Thank God because my old apartment had a ton of crap. So I had to like spend time dusting an entire entertainment unit. This for now I just have this and that makes me happy. So I'm just going to wipe this down real quick. But I like to use the Sprayway glass cleaner. I'll use that on the TV. And as well as the little floating shelf here. And then I'll be just about finished. So I can chat with you guys while I'm doing this. I just moved here so I'm still in the process of decorating. Um, and settling in as much as possible. Um, yeah. It's coming together little by little. I still have to get curtains and um, a few other pieces like wall art, but I'm going to take my time with that because I just want to choose pieces that I love. I just don't want to settle for the sake of filling up a home, you know? Right now, I'm comfortable. I'm happy with what I, with what I got so far and yeah, I'm just going to wait and I'm going to take my time. In the beginning when we moved here, we just splurged on like all the furniture and it becomes expensive after a while. So I'm on a little spending break, but I'm ready. Like I'm ready for the curtains. I think I'm going to get that more closer to spring. Like whatever I get now is going to be like more for spring, summer. I'm done winter shopping. Like we just got so much. I'm not even going to say it was a lot. It was more just costly stuff. It wasn't a lot. It was just costly. It was like the bed and the couch and the stools that I got. And yeah, it all adds up. You know but I wanted to start fresh I didn't want to bring anything from the apartment over here I just wanted new energy new vibe new look and as far as the look I'm going for more of a glam look and as I look around I feel like everything is great and that's not what I intended to buy but that's what I like to say chose me. Like sometimes you have a particular plan when it comes to decorating and sometimes when it comes to your space, you just gravitate towards things that basically call you. I had no intentions of, ma of making this house great, but I'm loving it. And yeah, that's what it turned out to be. I'm happy with it. And yeah, I think that's about it. So. I'm not going to clean the office, the bedroom, I have to do the bed sheets, wash bed sheets, so I'll save that for another day, possibly tomorrow, because I'm feeling a little bit sick, again, I don't want to overdo it, this was like the main space, the kitchen and the living room, this is what gets the messiest, the quickest, so I just wanted to tidy up here real quick, so Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you're new, welcome. My name is Erica. If you don't already know, please subscribe. Uh, click on the bell so you can get notifications every time that I do a new video. Um, any questions, requests, please leave them below. And yeah, thank you for watching. Have a great one. Before I go though, this is my favorite part. It's just how soothing and how everything looks once it's clean.
this is gonna stay out for a little while longer. But I just love Yeah, I plan on getting a little table here with a lamp for now. That's what it is. That's the mister's belongings. And I'm contemplating a big rug here. This was in my room, but we got better ones. So I'm using this for now. It's not permanent, but... I love it. How cute are these pillows though? It's not much, it's not big but I love the space that I have to work with.